Immunochemistry Technologies easy-to-use MitoPT kits assess cell health by detecting changes in the mitochondrial membrane potential of whole cells in vitro. ICT's MitoPT dyes include JC1, TMRE, and TMRM. They are fluorescent lipophilic cationic redistribution dyes. Their hydrophobic properties enable them to easily penetrate living cells as well as the membranes of the mitochondria. To use MitoPT, grow cells to your target concentration and expose them to your experimental conditions. The cells can be grown in suspension or as adherent cells which can be trypsinized before staining. Create positive controls by exposing cells to CCCP, a mitochondrial depolarizing agent which is included with the kit. Next, reconstitute and dilute MitoPT, then add it to each sample and incubate. MitoPT reagents are cell permeant, so there is no need to lyse or permeabilize the cells. After the incubation, remove the media and wash the cells with assay buffer. Finally, analyze your samples with a fluorescence microscope, plate reader, or flow cytometer. In healthy non-apoptotic cells with polarized inner mitochondrial membranes, MitoPT reagents will accumulate inside the negatively charged mitochondria and fluoresce bright red or orange upon excitation. If the cell is undergoing some form of metabolic stress or apoptosis, the mitochondrial membrane potential will collapse, leading to the depolarized state. In this condition, mitochondria will no longer retain and concentrate the mitopt dyes, leading to their rapid dispersal throughout the cytosol. This causes a change in the fluorescence properties of the mitopt reagents. JC1 will change from red-orange to green fluorescence, while the intense red-orange fluorescence of TMRE and TMRM reagents will simply drop to background levels. For more information on Immunochemistry Technologies MitoPT kits, please visit our website at www.immunochemistry.com or contact us at 1-800-829-3194.